Hi everyone at English Martyrs, I hope you're all okay and have had a fantastic Easter holiday with your family members. Now as we start the new term, I thought it'd be really good to keep the word of the week going because a lot of you over the last couple of weeks have sent in your home liturgies that you've been doing based on a word of the week of your own choice which is fantastic and have been really really good. We usually use the word of the week to focus our thoughts and our prayers on and normally our whole school liturgy is based on the word of the week and I know that in your classes you work together with the chaplaincy team to plan your own liturgies based on that same word of the week. And we wanted to keep that going. We want to see what you can do at home to show the special word. You might want to do your own home liturgy based on the word of the week or you might want to write a prayer or a poem or do a piece of artwork. The, the list is endless, you can do so much with the word of the week. If you're in year 5 and 6 it would be an ideal opportunity for you to look up some scripture as well to keep your bible knowledge up to scratch and see if there's anything that you can link to because I know you're all very very good at that. Now the word of the week this week is good news and we've just celebrated Easter which is Jesus rising again which is the ultimate good news. He died for us and he rose again. We as Catholics and as part of the church and school are asked to spread the good news at every possible opportunity. In fact Pope Francis tells us and teaches us that the good news is to be shared with everybody we know whether that's people of our own religion, our friends, our family or people who aren't quite sure. Now you might feel like at the moment there's not much good news going around but I want you to look out for some because there's definitely good news out there. I know at home a lot of you have been drawing and painting rainbows and that symbol of a rainbow is a symbol and sign of hope and strength but also a sign of God's promise which is the good news. There is a lot of good news out there and I want you to try and find it and focus on it. If you have any good news you'd like to share with us, then please email your teachers. Likewise, if you'd like to email me, then my email address is on the Year 5 6 school page on the website. Now this week, I'm really looking forward to working in school with the key worker children, and I'm really excited to find out what good news that they'd like to share. Now keep an eye out on the school website, as I'm sure we'll be sharing some of the things that they're doing in school. I hope you have a fantastic week, keep spreading that good news and keep smiling and I'll see you again next week for the new word of the week.